uh, hello traders today we are going to discuss about the traders the two uh, the traders you are one traders who are trading with accuracy of 86 percent since the one year so accuracy is pretty well here another trader trading with accuracy of 14 percent since the six months only Apart from that, it's still able to make a profit of $2,000. And another trader who is trading since the one year with that much good accuracy, he make a loss of $8,000, so almost 87% of the capital wipe out. So you'll see the difference and why and what are the reasons. These are, these are the all his trade history as we can see that the trade has started in 2019-10-12 and uh, oh no, the trader has started to trade on the date since 2019 5th of the month at 15 date so we can zoom and you can see that the total profit loss is eight thousand dollar and um, major loss in the euro usd and another trader made a two thousand dollar profit within a five months the trade has started with a ten thousand dollar and check the dates the once the trade has started and uh, another trader has started the trade on 2019 October month. So why this happened with 86% accuracy he made a loss. So that means that accuracy is not a major factor in considering the profit and loss but risk reward pattern that is what matters. So we will see the analyzing his trade patterns who made a loss of $8,700. Here we can see that he started the trading and in the beginning of the October, November and December he made a good profit of 45%. He again January and February made a good profit and almost doubled his capital with 100%. As 5,000, 6,000, so. But later on, what happened? That his trade is making the loss. Again, June made a loss 7,000, 3,000, 4,000 dollars. And end of the year, he reduced his profit to 13,000 and left the capital with 8,700 only. The loss he made in a whole almost two years period of time. See, the month he started and almost, so that's pretty bad happen with the traders. And why this thing happened is the major factor on the trade set, we can see average win is only $27 and average loss is 213 Number of trades and uh, accuracies you can see that the winning accuracy is 86 percent after that 86 percent accuracy not able to make a single profit in his account Number of trades we are going to check here yeah, total trades placed 1853 
the number of trade is 1853 with accuracy of 86 percent but we have seen that average profit and loss which is the bigger and that risk reward pattern is not followed as should be followed and uh, another account we can see that he has only placed the 55 trades accuracy is only 14 percent winning percentage so very less as you say number of trades are less but winning percentage is only 14 percent but we see here that his average win is 1070 and average loss is only 138 so he only made a win of 9 and loss is 47 but still he at the end of the each and every month able to get the $2,000 profit you can see that total profit he covered is So both the trades and their patterns are only depending on the risk and reward patterns. As the risk here it is followed the $138 only. So 47 trader 47 loss risk was followed by 138 and 8 trade profitable with a net $8,000 profit. So risk is very controlled here. Risk is around $6,000 only. So the end, end of the first fifth month he might able to pack at this much profit you see the consistent trades and uh, this month is still not end and uh, he followed suppose he is continuing to follow this pattern he can able to make because almost you can see that risk reward is almost 1 by 10 or 1 by 9 you can say which is a very very good so if you follow 1 by 10 risk reward pattern with the 10 to 15 percent accuracy is more than enough to make a profit but if you follow a signal we are able to get uh, risk reward of 1 by 5 or 1 by 6 with 80 percent accuracy you can see that you can easily make profit with that much accuracy and uh, other things we can see the portfolio correlation trade analysis where his frequency of the trades are uh, in a holding period of 15 to 16 hours where maximum profit he made in 16 hours of holding and uh, accuracy is uh, very less as profit is only 15 percent and loss is 85 percent but loss ratio are higher and win ratio is less you can see more red lines in here the more reds compared to the greens are very uh, very few it's eight trades only he made a profit and 47 trade he lose but still with the 14 percent accuracy we can so it's a mathematical number it's undeniable and see the trades would happen in his trade 86 percent accuracy see the profit is 87 percent here is all the profit trades but his account is into the loss of eight thousand dollar after the one year period of time see the many profitable trades and very few loss trades these are all the profit trades and these are all the loss trades so what happened here that what he did actually is booking the profit of 27 dollar in each trade but he's making the loss of more than 250 this is his loss is higher than the profit so the accuracy doesn't matter if you follow this bad risk and reward patterns which is less than 1 point which is less than 0.5 or 0.2 only so your risk reward is major factor in a trading you have to maintain it minimum 1 gem 0.5 to 1 gem 1 but if you follow with the risk reward of 1 gem 5 with the 30 percent accuracy you can make the profit and with the 1 gem 10 you can make a profit with the 15 percent accuracy that we have already shown the traders account 
with the one gem 10 risk reward he made a profit of two thousand dollars here risk reward is less but see the made a profit and here the risk reward is worse so at the end of both the years he made a loss and the uh, total 8700 loss with 86 percent accuracy so it doesn't matter your accuracy only the matter is that you to see the many many trades but see the peeps are very less here we can see many trades has placed here many many trades all are the peeps in profit and loss into the peeps small small peeps gain the loss are because see the very few losses but once the loss is there see the 250 dollar loss he made it here into the gbpsd buy so you keep holding keep holding so it's not good if you are booking the profit it should be the bigger than your loss and you have to keep your strict sl size so these are not properly disciplined trades All the trades with a very good profit ratio you can see but few trades made a loss of 250 pips and it made a big huge loss into his account so we do not recommend this type of the risk reward pattern into any trades you might have to avoid it in the same pattern see the two thousand dollar portfolio here what happened there are many losses but the profit are consistent with the higher side see the profit is 68 pips 96, 200, 160, 3900 pips. Loss are very fixed size, 6 pip only. So he made a good profit with a few trades. Trades quantity are very less. See, you can see only the 47 trades plus with the out of only 8 trades in the profit. Other trades are all into the loss. But stick this reward pattern. If he keep on following it, maybe he can double his capital at the end of the year. There are the many chances because he's keep improving his trading skills. He's keep making the big profit. He's holding it. He's keep he's making the patience in his into his trades. And uh, booking the loss, he's very happy to book the loss. He doesn't even care. Six pip he booked the loss. Sixty two dollar with the one lot. It's okay. He's booking the loss of sixty two dollars. And making the profit of two thousand dollars, one thousand six hundred dollars, nine hundred dollars. So easy to recover the losses. So he need to improve the, his accuracy level by adjusting the stop loss little bit bigger side, little bit bigger side. So the many losses can be reduced and follow the proper level and book the big profit. He can make a, with a two thousand dollar profit. He could able to make six to seven thousand dollar profit. So these are the both the client's account which we have seen as uh, total history of the trades you can see here two thousand dollar profit with a few trades only 48 trades and these other clients with many trades many many trades around 1800 trades but but at end of the things end of the one year we made a loss of eight thousand seven hundred dollars unfortunately this is things happen in the forex market even see the account of the client who is already making a very good profit in the initial of the month so he got overconfident you can see that he made a profit one thousand three thousand dollar four thousand dollar again five thousand dollar in a february later on he thought that his strict reward pattern is okay but he kept booking the losses and now almost his capital is wiped out and his profit is even gone all the 5000 profit almost he had made a double profit of his capital but all are wiped out so hopefully these are the sad thing happened to the client so these are all the trades and his account history and account balance So here he followed 86 percent accuracy and 1800 trades but his risk reward pattern is 27 profit and 210 dollars so almost 0.2 only is the risk reward pattern so he made a loss of 8700 dollars same with the client with a very few trades 
with accuracy of only 15% profit rate accuracy only 40 15% accuracy but see the his average profit rates are 1700 dollar profit and average loss rate are 130 so risk reward pattern almost one gym by nine so it's a pretty good and he made a profit of two thousand dollar at the end of the fifth month and hopefully if we follow it he can his chart can go more higher side it can reach to the ten thousand dollar profit if you just follow our level more precisely and follow uh, reduce the risk and uh, if we follow the levels then there are chances that his loss ratio can reduce and he can able to get 60 to 90 percent accuracy by following our signals so we are already talking about the traders and we are into the beginning of the trade that how they can improve their levels of the trading hope you enjoyed uh, this analysis of about the traders if you have any doubt feel free to ask us thank you very much